Hello everyone and welcome to WD18, the Watford fan channel. Now I'm back for another transfer video. I haven't done one of these in a while due to the lack of transfer activity from Watford, but it's really sparked a life in the last few days. And today it's been confirmed that Gerard Delefeu will be joining Watford on loan. He's off for a medical tomorrow. He's flying from Spain, from Barcelona to Watford to get the uh, move completed. It's going to be a loan move without an option to buy at the end of the season. A number of journalists, including Adam Leventhal, our uh, trusted Watford correspondent, has confirmed that he will be signed in the next 24 hours, hopefully. And I think it's a really, really good move from Watford. I think the right mid is somewhere where we need to strengthen. And some other big news coming out of Watford today, also from Adam Leventhal, confirming that we're in for a defensive midfielder and an attacker. Now, those they haven't been named yet, considering we're going for Delafeu as a right midfielder. Another attacker is going to come in and another defensive midfielder. And with all our injuries coming back, it could be a really strong squad. But I think it's essential that we do get some names in before uh, the deadline closes on Wednesday. Potential outgoings now, really interesting one. Stefano Akaka looks to be going out on loan to Fulham for the rest of the season. Um, it's come after reports to his old club. Um, Stefano obviously hasn't been playing a lot of first-team football under Marco Silva. Um, and he only came on against Gracia, so clearly both managers don't rate him too highly, even though I'd probably say he's our best striker and our best outlet. Um, Andre Gray got given the nod against him against Southampton. Um, Troy Dean is obviously coming back, and he's had links of moving him away to West Brom. So interesting to see that Akaka is going to be shipped off to Fulham on loan. The deal hasn't been done yet, but there's strong links moving him away. And he's going to drop down a division to meet uh, former Watford manager Slavisi Ikanovic. I touched on the Troy Dean to West Brom links. Um, that came out yesterday. £60 million bid uh, West Brom put in initially. Um, and obviously Watford did reject that. And you've got to put in perspective, guys, that Watford's... Um, whatever we sell uh, Troy Dean for, 25% of that goes to Walsall as we bought him from there initially. So you've got the only, Watford only making around £12 million off it. And then plus agent fees. They're looking at quite a low sum. Transfer deadline day does shut on Wednesday at midnight so we'll have to see how the deals progress but by the looks of it we're going to sign Delafeu tomorrow on loan to the end of the season a six month loan deal and a defensive midfielder and an attacker um, two names that haven't been confirmed yet but we'll have to wait and see if they go through and Troy Deeney has been linked with the move away to West Brom if that goes through I'm not too sure I don't think it will now uh, Daniel Sturridge is going to West Brom um, we'll have to wait and see but let me know what you think of the transfer rumours down in the comment section below. Leave a like if you haven't enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, we're nearing 2,000 subscribers, so make sure you do subscribe. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.